Welcome to Research Branch. Today we will be discussing Game Swift. That is a platform aims to redefine the gaming industry by integrating blockchain technology into its ecosystem. It offers a suite of innovative products and services designed to enhance the gaming experience for developers, players and other stakeholders. It is not only a gaming uh, game launcher, it provides a lot of features for the gamers and the developers alike. As you can see, they are integrating all of the gaming at one place, creating a one-stop solution for all of the gamers. Their decentralized and interoperable system allows users to create a Web3 gaming identity. This unique identity enables players to log into their favorite games with a single click. It provides a unified platform where players can view all their gaming achievements. Here is the, the platform. The users can or the gamers can get in and start playing the game different uh, games with using just one wallet. If you are a Web3 gamer, you know that what is the process. Create a wallet, securing the seed phrase, on ramp your fiat, get to DEX or SEX buying the fiat, purchasing different cryptocurrencies, ETH, Matic, Sol, BNB for different blockchains. If the game is on BNB chain, you will be purchasing the BNB tokens. If the game is on Solana chain, you will be purchasing Sol or other different tokens. Same for the Matic and Ethereum. Then find the right place, the market place to purchase the NFTs. And buy the in-game assets. Then download and play the game. That is the usual process. But with the game Swift, log into, the, log into uh, game Swift with using your Google, Facebook or Apple ID. The built-in wallet is created automatically for you. You don't need to get involved with Web3 identity. Just buy NFTs using your debit card and play the game. There is, it's a hassle-free roadmap for the gamers to get in Web3. That, that is their vision and they have already been doing it. There are a lot of features that provide one-stop gaming ecosystem, game swift, ID, and high quality products. With GSP, Game Swift Pay is a payment system that allows users to monetize their in-game treasures. It also offers benefits like airdrops, higher staking rewards, and cashback. For Game Swift Pay, there are a lot of monetization methods also available. GameSwift facilitates various, various stakeholders in the gaming ecosystem that involves gaming developers, gamers, content creators, and general users. For game developers, they have a software development kit that allows developers to implement a Web3 layer into their games. This makes it easier for developers to build Web3 games and integrate blockchain technology. For gamers, they can create a Web3 gaming identity, allowing them to log into their favorite games with one account. They can view all their gaming achievements, stats, assets, including NFTs at one place. The GSP system allows gamers to monetize their in-game treasures, providing a new avenue for earning. For content creators, they can benefit from the transparency and traceability of blockchain technology integrating into games. They can create content around their gaming achievements, stats and share with their audience.
so this is a general introduction about the game swift as they have a lot of products for the gamers the community uh, and the game developers now we will be delving into the benefits or the perks for the game for the gamers and the gaming community what is in it in game swift for gamers they can acquire the web3 identity it allows users to create a unique gaming profile with a single account then don't need to get multiple web3 wallets like metamask or phantom or any other wallet for different scenes they can play all of the games at one place whether the game is developed at solana or any other chain bnb ethereum arbitrum avalanche or at any chain they can play all of these games at one place and using only one identity that is game swift id it is a unique platform with centralized location for players to view all their gaming achievements it is decentralized and interoperable the infrastructure is fully decentralized can interact with multiple blockchain networks this ensures that players can enjoy the gaming experience without any restrictions it promotes cross chain interoperability so it is a truly one stop gaming ecosystem including all of the chains all of the wallets and identities at one place we will be dis discussing the game swift chain later on let's discuss the game swift analytics it is a feature that game swift provides unique tools to help users understand the play style and gaming efficiency it offers detailed stats and advanced prediction models enabling users to develop strategies to improve their gaming experience the key features include detailed stats advanced prediction models and user friendly interface the analytics platform is designed to be user friendly making it easy for users to navigate and understand their stats so this is there is a lot for the gamers let's delve into the developer perspective what is in it for the developers game swift sdk it is a tool set created for developers to integrate the web3 layer into their games it is a multi platform meaning developers can build their games for pc mobile or even browsers the sdk provides all necessary web3 tools through a specially optimized api based technical environment it is for multi platform and connecting with multiple uh, with different engines with unreal or unity the uh, unity engine it is very simply uh, simplifies the app uh, dev development allows developers to craft secure top notch dapps without delving into complex coding languages when we are discussing about game swift let's give some time for their web3 infrastructure for the game swift chain the game swift chain is a unique layer proof of stake network that is part of game swift platform It is designed specifically for gaming applications and offers several key features that include gaming optimized, cross-chain interoperable, secure by secure in all forms and fully carbon neutral. They have modular structure. It comprises a game game optimized layer and ZK EVM rollup design. on demand for specific games
it is the platform users can create their identity using here user can acquire their profile and get their web3 identity using the wallets they can connect their wallets they can add their uh, web3 wallets like phantom metamask or any wallet they want to connect with this and they have a bridge there are a lot of features here it, here it is the light paper we will go through it very swiftly like the game swift game swift has their own token it means you acquire one token for multiple tokens that you don't need to navigate with different tokens for different games you can acquire one token for all of the games and get your earnings there are staking rewards at attached with this token as well we know it is very hectic to navigate in web3 because there are different chains and the chains are just multiplying and a lot of games are developed at different chains and there is always a FOMO, fear of missing out the great games in different chains. Means if I am playing a game in Solana, I could miss a great game in Avalanche chain. But in Game Swift, all of the games are present at one place, at one stop. And you don't need to navigate through different wallets. That is creating a value. And of course, for playing different games, you don't need to pay for gas fees. Their core thesis is that most gamers are not full-time investors, so we should not force them to invest in volatile assets and spend money on gas fees just to process transactions. Instead, we should provide them with immersive games and a straightforward gasless environment where the blockchain is just the technology working in the background. That is a great vision behind Game Swift. Game Swift token. Let's check out their token. Here's the Game Swift token. The current price is 0.57 and 1.27% down in one day. In 7 days, they are 4% down. In 1 month, they are 24% high. Here you can get their white paper website. The total supply 1 million. And max supply 1 million 39. 1 billion 39, uh, 396 million. The circulating supply is only 4.48%. It means they will be releasing more tokens in coming uh, years or coming months that will definitely uh, lower the price. Do your own research before investing. It is not an investment in any terms. It is not an advice of investment in any terms. It is just for explore, explanation purpose and for education. There are different uh, there are different exchanges like Bybit and decentralized exchanges. The game developers can be the uh, node runners for this blockchain as well. Yeah, there is uh, here's a very important stats. They uh, they know the business that 2.9 billion gamers worldwide making up 180 billion business in games, and that is about to grow to 3.3 billion gamers by 2025. 
with 257 billion dollars in sales gaming is a huge industry and it is exploding with blockchain technology the best part is this we know as a gamer it will be a huge facilitation for the gamers just cutting down the long process to a short one for game developers it is a great opportunity with their SDKs for different platforms for Android, Windows, browsers and navigating through the different blockchains. We were discussing about the gas fees. Thanks to GameSwift, gamers don't need to connect a wallet or other external applications. They just need to perform one step, sign in using Google or Apple ID to download and play any Web3 game for extensive game library that is present at GameSwift. That is really an easy sign-in method. Here is their roadmap, the team formation, market research, they have done great and they are at, they have already released that product. Game Swift ID early access, chain test net, token listing, everything has been done here. These have been achieved so far. We have checked out the tokens. Here is the team. Their CEO and founder was a lawyer, lawyer and, and an advisor for various blockchain projects. Here is the CTO and their CMO, CEO. I have checked their LinkedIn profiles. They work in Star Heroes that is uh, being developed by GameSwift. They are working at GameSwift for two years and nine months. Their CTO, they are expert in senior tooling engineer with studios. They have been working there. They are full stack developer for a community. They have a great experience. CMO. She has been working in at GameSwift for one year and 11 months, two years almost, and she has been active in Star Heroes also. Before that, she was working with cloud-based crypto mining company. She has been in Web3 for a lot for a lot of time. She has great experience. Michael. They have a huge team and uh, that includes the Web3 savvy employees and managers, developers, marketers. They have developed their own chain. That is a big achievement for them and they are running a very great product. They have great partners in Web3 including Polygon and uh, gaming uh, joints, Dragon Masters, Space Cartels, Motodex, Soulcraft. Lazy Soccer, they have been doing great in Web3. So that's all for today. Have a great day. See ya.